Hello Leo, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is your angel messages reading for July 2020 for the sign of Leo. Okay, your card has fallen down. We have Shark. Lead, lead as a powerful, peaceful warrior. Archangels, Metatron and Jewels. I mean, this is about taking the lead, isn't it? Okay, message for Leo please angels, what is the message that Leo needs to hear for July 2020 please, message for our lovely Leos please, thank you. Oh, okay, we have forgiveness and forgiveness is a form of release Leo. Um, it enables us to release something, to allow us to move forward. If we hold on to things, it hampers us moving forward in our lives. So forgiveness is generally for us. Um, action, and then take action. You know, this is beautiful energy. It just feels like possibilities. Now is the time to take action. And lead as a powerful, peaceful warrior. Hey Leo, what is the message for Leo please angels? What is the message for Leo? We have Angel of Wealth. Financial flow comes easily to you this month. <laughs> this is beautiful. And I kind of feel with that warrior imagery, it may well have been difficult for you. Let's see what we get on the cards, Leo. So I'm only going to pull three cards, three independent cards. There's no order, there's no category. I am just doing an intuitive read this for this uh, angel messages reading. So what do we have for Leo, please, angels? Message for Leo, thank you. King of Swords. Ace of Cups. Two of Swords. And we have the Fool. So I love this energy, Leo, because the King of Swords is an energy, is a leader. He is somebody who is at the height of his suit. And the Swords energy is to do with the mind, clear thinking, power of the mind enables you to have clear vision and understand the strategy that you need to do to fulfill that vision. He is somebody who makes decisive action, decisive decisions, um, quick thinking. He is exceptionally intelligent. And this is about somebody who is a visionary, having a plan and understanding or making a plan. It's almost kind of like the big game plan here um, towards achieving the goal. And this is somebody who is on a cliff. So there's another message here in terms of you need to see the big picture. You need to step back and see the big picture. If things become unclear this month in terms of how you need to act in order to bring this financial flow into your life, you need to step back and reevaluate your plan, your strategy. This is about having a strategy and carrying it through because that's how he absolutely I mean he's a strategist he's a he is strategic he's a clear thinker so it's interesting Leo because I feel the goal is this the ace of cups what is going to make you happy I feel this is to do with an opportunity here you know the ace of cups can be an opportunity that brings you joy it can be in love but it can be also something that brings you joy happiness um, this can be self-love this can be something that brings you just fulfillment, something that you really want, you know, there's an emotional connection to this. Getting something that, you know, wanting to achieve something that you really want to make happen here. And it is possible because we have the, the hand of God, the divine, the universe saying, this is on offer to you, but you need to take action towards it now. Um, big message to trust your intuition as well. 
have a plan trust your intuition with this too because I'm saying that because of this card two of swords now two of swords can sometimes be when you might be looking in the wrong places for answers there is a need to see the big picture in order to make decisions choices here and there is also a need to also make sure this plan this strategy is in line with your inner knowing your intuition what your instinct is telling you and how you should be moving forward here because yeah the two of swords can be somebody who is stuck because they don't feel they've got the facts of the situation they don't feel they are in a position to make a decision or choice here and it's because they're looking in the wrong direction or they're actually not looking properly at they're not looking at the right thing that's what I'm feeling uh, because the moon energy in the top right hand corner is saying in order to make judgments decisions this month you need to be guided by your intuition yeah and that's what I feel that two of swords is representing for you and it is leading to this the new beginning and I feel this is what absolutely this is this is leading towards the king of swords the new beginning the fool it's a beautiful energy of anything's possible when you really put your mind to it and this is a card of really opening your mind you know even more so than the king of swords I mean the king of swords sees a big picture the fool energy sees the world sees your world and understands how I need to move forward now because it is Uranus energy it is God of the sky looking down on the world you know so there's a feeling here of really open your mind to all possibilities and I feel then have a plan have a strategy towards the vision because for some of you I feel that there is an opportunity here for financial flow um, it says finances here so I'm kind of going with that something that is going to bring you happiness here now is the time to take action release what you need to release you know it might have been a battle to get here Leo but this is about lead as a powerful peaceful warrior so now is the time to just take the lead in your life and get a plan get a game plan on um, because I do feel the opportunity is within your grasp here it's a beautiful beautiful energy yeah the Sun <laughs> the Sun and below that it did come out so you know the Sun and three of Pentacles put in the hard work and you start getting a small level of success this is financial success can be in terms of career jobs business ventures teamwork uh, projects you kind of get what I'm saying but the Sun is coming through a difficult period because the child and the horse come through a wall and they're fully illuminated fully clear in terms of where they're going what they're setting their sights on and how to get there and the Sun can also represent everything's going to be okay things are looking up so it's a it's a feel-good energy it's an uplifting energy it's also a card of good news and material success and I feel it's linked to this three of Pentacles the new beginning with the fool I mean it's kind of on track towards what those cards were saying so beautiful beautiful energy the message is get a plan the big game plan <laughs> and I think everything everything stems from that Leo <laughs> okay what is the message for Leo please message for Leo final message angels what is the final message thank you for Leo we have horse free spirit I mean this feels like new beginnings as well give yourself the space and freedom to express your creativity and also you know that that also feels like the full energy you know just open yourself up to all possibilities and then focus on a target beautiful energy Leo I hope you enjoyed the reading if you did please do like share and subscribe I hope it's a wonderful month for you and I will see you next time thank you